welcome back to John and Mandy Go RVing. In today's episode, we are touring the Uniontown KOA Holiday, which is located in Connellsville, Pennsylvania. This campground is situated between the Yakagani River and the Great Allegheny Passage Bike Trail, which is about an hour south of Pittsburgh. We found the sites at the Uniontown KOA to be medium to small, depending on where you are assigned. We were in the A section. Each site included a picnic table and fire ring. There wasn't room at our site for our second vehicle, but there is plenty of space in overflow parking. If you don't have a tent or an RV, there are vacation rentals, cabins, or even stationary RVs to rent. Check them out on their website as there are many different options. As you enter the campground, the main building will be on your right. Here you'll find one of the two bathhouses in the campground. They were clean and well maintained. You can access the coin-operated laundry 24 hours a day and I was very happy to see a change machine. Propane is also sold on site. Just ask at the office for assistance. The main building houses the registration office and store. It has a few small tables outside in case you want to enjoy an ice cream cone from the store. The store had souvenirs, a few grocery items, and camping essentials. You could even order a pizza and have it delivered right to your site. There are two pools open from Memorial Day to Labor Day. Unfortunately, we were too late in the season to enjoy a swim. While you're here, stop by the trading post. There's always some activity like crafts or bingo. There was even a dance one night during our stay. The playground has swings, slides, climbing poles, and a mini rock wall. There's also lily pad steppers, a half court for basketball, and a gaga pit. The bark park is located near the play area and has plenty of room for your furry friends. The Yakagani River runs along one side of the campground. Here, you can rent canoes, kayaks, and inner tubes. There's even a shuttle that takes you three miles upriver so you can float back down to the campground. Running right through the campground is the Great Allegheny Passage. This rail trail totals 150 miles and is great for hiking or biking. So now we're going to go down the GAP trail, which is a rail trail. And it goes right through the campground.
This plot of land we see before us was once the land of Colonel William Crawford, who was an American soldier and surveyor who worked as a Western land agent for George Washington. Colonel Crawford fought in the French and Indian War, as well as the American Revolutionary War. During the French and Indian War, this area was also a resting point for Major General Edward Braddock and his army during their advance to capture Fort Duquesne in 1755. Expecting victory, Braddock's army was surprised and defeated by French and Indian forces over a week later on July 9, 1755 at the Battle of the Wilderness, also known as the Battle of Monongahela, about seven miles from Fort Duquesne. A few notable surviving members of this army who became great future leaders include Colonel George Washington, who later became our first president, Lieutenant Colonel Thomas Gage, and civilian Daniel Boone. Thanks everyone for joining us today, and if you found any of this information useful, please give us a like and feel free to subscribe. Take care everyone.